If you truly want to rank in Google, you cannot trust the keyword difficulty that SEO tools give you. The good thing is that this new secret feature now lets you get the true difficulty. If you search any keyword in the main SEO tools, which are Ahrefs or SEMrush, you will always see a keyword difficulty. The problem is that it's not really reliable and it's simplified. Even the tools themselves tell you this. The problem is that people might have a keyword research and they might only look at the keywords with a low keyword difficulty. I did this for years and and then I always wondered why I didn't rank. Instead, what you actually have to do is scroll down and then you'll see the actual Google results. And the great stuff is that it gives you a lot of data about each of the ranking websites. So you should look at things like, are they actually targeting the keyword in the titles and URLs? Do they have a strong SEO score called DR from zero to 100? Do they get traffic and do they rank for keywords or they don't? The problem with this is that you have to do it manually per each keyword and it takes a lot of time. So one day I was just looking around and I grab all my target keywords in my research. I put them in the SEO tool to see some of their data. And then I went to export and I saw this toggle. I was shocked. Basically, what it lets you do is export the top 10 competitors, basically the data you saw in the SERPs, but for many keywords at once instead of one by one. So when you export, you get something like this. And now if you know a bit about Excel or Google Sheets, you can actually see a lot of useful information. Like for example, if we go to the DR column, you can see the average DR and then the maximum and the minimum. So using a few scary looking formulas, I managed to transfer all that data to my research, which by the way, if you want a free template with the formulas and a full step-by-step -step tutorial, just comment difficulty and I'll give it to you in the comments. So now instead of filtering or sorting my keyword research by the keyword difficulty column, I could go to my other columns and filter by, for example, keywords that have a low average and that there's small DR websites ranking in it. And now I could trust that. I didn't have to go and look at the SERPs and I could create a page for that keyword. That's what I did with my client and I ranked way faster than before. Before I say it's your turn, I want to emphasize out of all the videos I've done on my YouTube channel, this is probably the most impactful one if you do it correctly. So comment difficulty, I'll give you the video and follow it step by step and it will literally change your SEO strategy because it did for all of my clients. And now it's truly your turn. Let's go.